Good morning. We are in the middle of nowhere. Literally the middle of nowhere, Indiana. But there's going to be a great card show. Great trade night last night. We had to start the day with some Donnie's because we couldn't find any Duncan in town. Um, sold off a lot of cards. And uh, it's freezing out, so let's get in there. First little deal. Up North Collectives. Nice little deal here, Brennan Davis. Appreciate the camera. So Stag and Sell gave me this bad boy right here, Steph Curry, 9.5 BGS, and he told me to flip it. He's giving it to me at 220, but everything I make on top after I sell it. So he's gonna make me some do. money, and he's gonna make some money. All, all good around, right, Dave? Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Dave just sold my car. Sold Dave, what, car. what'd you end up making here? I made five bucks. We're getting McDonald's for the free free today. Yeah. Let's go. Oh, Dodds. Dodds. Oh, no, no, this is yours. Oh, my. Thank you. Thank you. Never go Here's broke. Five. Never go broke taking a profit, Stack right, Dave? Stack guys. Stack inside. Let me know in the comments below, should I go to an Amish card show? It's something that we haven't tried out yet, but I think it could be something. Haven't gotten a lot of deals done today. Not... I'm looking for chrome first, and I'm looking for color, and you'll see, I got a little bit of that. But I'm not seeing exactly what I wanted. But, still having a good time. So, first car I picked up is HGA Tua, uh, uh, HGA 9. I'm honestly just picking it up. I'm gonna sell the card, but I just wanna do a cracking video of just showing how to crack HGA slabs. Um, PC pickup, 10 bucks. First edition sky blue foil. Um, I'm just not gonna find a PSA 10 of her, his Air crochet at that price uh picked this in a lot with these two i think i paid 60 bucks on the pair so i was happy with that uh charles won last week i got that in a lot with these so i got the charles the lewis and the lando refractor all for 100 bucks so i was happy with that got that at five got that at two and that's out of 75 got that at five and i was like albie's auto patch five bucks can't go wrong uh, Vinatieri autos, if y'all see them, I don't know exactly what this one goes for, but I paid like five bucks on it. So if you guys find kicker autos, kicker hall of fame autos usually do really well for me. And then I just picked these two up. Don't know exactly who they are, but it's gold. This one's the yellow out of 75. Um, just wanted some clean raw stuff to send out this week. So we're going to get back in there. Hopefully get some more deals. Um, super congested in there. So many people. Um, but it's more like low, not lower end, but lower to mid end. And it's just not the stuff that it's not like I'm saying like this stuff's bad in there, but it's not like what I'm looking for. So maybe it changes in the next hour. Maybe we go sell some more cards. Um, let's go get in there. <music> Yeah, I see KPJ, I see a Jordan Poole, CD Lamb die cut, and the Tyrese Max so far. Nice, nice. How about you, Sosak? So nice little Bryce Mitchell. Well, I like this. It's a nice uh, mix of different stuff. It's a nice mix. Very fine. Duke Johns. Mahoney. Auto. See if that uh, Dave, What's up? what are you looking for right now? Right now, I just got some dry food. I'm the guy, I have a buyer for it, so you gotta see what your basic, like, if you have a lot of people that like certain things, you gotta just target that, you know? Yeah. So, you like, I have people who buy Aaron Judge, Shohei Atani, and stuff like that, so I'm targeting that majority. How about you? Do you have any uh, I'm looking mainly for baseball right now. I mean, I'll look at anything. Yeah. Like, I mean, I'm mainly not looking for like base stuff like this, but like color, I'm cool with. Let's see. We could work with that. I'm just trying to find like a good, good, nice lot. So, like it makes sense because he's doing a lot of stuff done, and then I'm buying, and I could do the work. I really don't mind that. So. All right, guys, it's 
It's a couple days after the show. It is Monday today. Did not go to a show yesterday. I need to catch up on sleep, A, eh? taxes, and uh, good health. So just need a couple days to think. Um, overall, had a great time at the show. Talked to some amazing people. Everybody that came up to me or I came in up to your table and I talked to. Really appreciate it if you guys support the vlogs or support the Instagram. Lots of big things coming soon. But had a great time at the show, like I said again. Uh, B Sports put on a great show. I'm, I'm hopefully going to be back in May again at the end. It's May 30th, the next show. Like I said multiple times, I did not find exactly what I was looking for. But looking back, reflecting, I was a little too picky this weekend, honestly. Um, I came in with looking for clean F1 and clean Bowman Chrome first. And I was just too picky. I should have pulled the trigger on a lot of things that I just did not pull the trigger on. And that is personally my fault. That's not anybody at the show's fault. It's not whoever runs the show's fault. That's my fault. So really hope I really hope I could take that into next weekend, pull the trigger on more stuff. I got to use more of my knowledge that I preach in the way that find some things, find some cards at someone's table, build a lot, try to get down to 70, 80 percent, whatever. So it makes sense margins wise for me. Um, so I got to I got to do what I'm preaching a little bit more, honestly. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Peace.